In this tutorial, we show you how to perform DFM checks with FAT3000. You may verify all the DFM rules which will be used during your check. There are also various other DFM settings. All errors are color coded so you're able to tell the level of urgency simply by their colors. FAT3000 makes it easy to navigate and browse all DFM errors such as these acid traps, which may cause problems during etching. FAT3000 will also allow you to securely, safely, and easily generate your own detailed PDF report files which show all DFM errors, making it easy to share with colleagues. Everything's done right on your desktop, safely, securely, and fast. FAT3000 will import Gerber files, drill, route, and also netlist files simultaneously by simply selecting the folder. As you see here, we're going to go ahead and show some of the test points from the imported IPC netlist. At this point, what we're going to do is extract a netlist, which means FAT3000 is going to generate its own netlist from the Gerber files. And you can now view those extracted nets easily by selecting whichever net you wish to look at. Now for netlist comparison, we're going to go ahead and compare the imported IPC netlist against the netlist FAT3000 just generated. As you'll see here, FAT3000 is detected in open and a short in the nets, which means that the Gerber does not match up with the actual IPC netlist that was generated. A quick inspection here shows you that there's a segment missing. Should you send these Gerber files out to manufacturing, you're going to be very disappointed with the results. Fortunately, FAB3000 found those errors and pinpointed them to you so you may make any necessary changes.